everybody wants a job. Just about everybody wants a job. And trying to find those jobs was so difficult. Now, a woman in Allegan County is doing something about it. She's helping create opportunities for people with disabilities. She's now teamed up with a nonprofit to launch a dog treat business, giving workers a chance to get in the community and gain a sense of purpose. Fox 17's Janice Allen introduces us to Robin Lavender, our Pay It Forward Person of the Month, brought to you by Lake Michigan Credit Union. I know it was important that we do something, um, and that's kind of how this was born. They say if you love what you do, you won't work a day in your life. It's certainly true for Kevin Cook and Tess Molenbelt, who love coming to work. Gets us out of the house, and then we see cool people. Cutting out and baking these all-natural dog treats. Best job is making the dogs happy. <laughs> yeah. These two have a job because of another woman who fell in love with her job years ago. I've just been in special ed all my life, all my career life. Love it. We've got three, so we need two more to two more pans. It was love at first sight. Robin Lavender retired in 2012, but she couldn't stay away for long. So when she was approached about being on the board of the ARC in Allegan County, a nonprofit that advocates for those with developmental disabilities, she had just one request. I said, I would love to do that. However, my caveat is I would love the board to get on board with uh, starting a business, a dog treat business, for folks to be hired uh, with disabilities to actually get a paycheck and to earn a living. Beyond Bones is the result. The business makes dog treats using ingredients like apples, peanut butter, and cinnamon. I got two dogs, and I guess they love the treats. Yeah. And you love the treats? Yep. <laughs> My dogs love the treats too. We have 17 individuals employed, paid employment, so they're all um, part-time employees, and we bake four days a week, um, Monday through Thursday. And now we have two locations, so we have this location here in Wayland, and we also bake um, at a location in Allegan. Without Robin, I don't think we would be here where we're at in this short period of time. Robin says it's just the beginning. She has dreams of opening a retail store this summer, and down the line, dog walking and doggy daycare. It just it just makes my heart smile and it makes me happy and to be with these guys again, um, so much fun and it's so pleasing to see that they're having fun, they're making some money, they feel good about themselves. Um, I'll tell you, it brings tears to my eyes every time I back up and look and watch and uh, it, it's just awesome and yeah, it does fulfill me big time. You know, to be retired and being able to do something like this, you know, towards the end of your life, oh my gosh, it doesn't get any better. Not at all. For Tess and Kevin, it's not just the paycheck, but the new purpose they've earned that keeps them looking forward to coming back. I love this job. I will work until I die. I love this job. In Wayland, Janice Allen, Fox 17 News. So uh, congrats to Robin. Looks like you've created quite the business there. And if you're interested, you can find Beyond Bones in a ton of different places, local farmers markets, crane orchards, paws and claws in Allegan, or you can just buy them online. And we've posted more information about the story on fox17online.com. And as our winner, Robin is getting a $550, $550 prize. That's awesome. And hey, if you know someone who should be featured next, well, just head to the Pay It Forward section on fox17online.com and tell us all about them.